Thank you for choosing the iSpring Whole House Water Filtration System. In this video, we will show you how to properly install a UV filter in your water system. Before we begin, please carefully read the user manual and ensure your water pressure is below 85 psi. If daytime pressure is 80 psi, nighttime pressure may exceed the maximum limit. Use a pressure reduction valve to regulate inlet water pressure to 80 psi if necessary. Water temperature ranges from 32 degrees Fahrenheit to 100 degrees Fahrenheit. The system is intended for cold water use only. Do not run hot water through the system. Do not install this product outside or where exposed to direct sunlight or freezing temperatures. Ensure the TDS level is less than 120 ppm and the iron level is less than 0.3 ppm. This product is designed for residential use only. Contact iSpring customer service to inquire about using in non-residential settings. It is recommended to have a pre-filter installed before the system to achieve optimal performance. A water route bypass is also recommended to allow easier access to replace the pre-filter, UV bulb, and troubleshoot the system if any problems arise. Please check that all parts were included in the package and have all the required pipe connectors and tools ready. Preparation Step 1. Remove both open and closed end nuts from the stainless steel filter chamber. Step 2. Install an O-ring onto the open end of the quartz tube, half an inch from the edge. Step 3. Insert the quartz tube into the filter chamber and install the O-ring onto the closed end of the quartz tube. Step 4. Hand screw both open and closed end nuts on the filter chamber. Do not over tighten, as this may damage the O ring. Step 5 Place the seal O ring in the flow sensor connector. Install the flow sensor to the water outlet located on the closed end nut side. Step 6 Carefully insert the UV bulb into the quartz tube through the open end nut. Tightly connect the 4-pin electrical socket with UV bulb pins and install the cover cap onto the nut. Step 7. Install a 1-inch FNPT connector to the water inlet. Please be aware of the water flow direction. An inline converter may be needed depending on your piping size. Installation. Please note. Different setting requires different connecting setup. Connectors and adapters used in the installation are for demonstration only and are not included in the package. Step 1. In the desired location, mount the brackets to the wall and leave enough access room for future servicing. If you choose to vertical mount the filter, please ensure the water inlet is mounted at a lower level while the outlet is higher. Step 2. Adjust the height of the filter chamber and mount it to the brackets. Step 3. Shut off the main water line and open the nearest faucet to release water and pressure in the pipe. Step 4. Measure and cut the main water inlet pipe. Prepare a bucket to catch water from the pipe. Step 5. Connect the main water inlet pipe to the filter's water inlet. Connect the pipe entering the house to the filter's water outlet. A convert fitting may be needed for this connection depending on your setup. Installation is now complete. Step 6. Slowly turn on the water supply and check for leaks. Allow the water to run for a few minutes from a faucet to clear any air or dust in the water line and filter chamber. Step 7. Plug in the power supply to a 120-volt socket. Push the control switch button to the auto position. The UV filter will start working automatically when it detects water flow. Please note, the move position allows the UV filter to work continuously, and the stop position turns off the power of the UV filter. We recommend setting the switch in the auto position to save energy and protect the UV bulb. Step 8. Turn on the faucet and ensure the new UV bulb works properly. Step 9. Turn off the faucet and ensure the automatic flow switch shuts off automatically when the water stops flowing through. UV Bulb Replacement 
The intensity of UV light created by the bulb decreases over time. Therefore, the UV bulb is recommended to be replaced every 12 months for optimal performance. Please turn the switch button to the off position for your safety before replacing the UV bulb. Step 1. Ensure the control switch button is in the stop position. Step 2. Remove the cover cap from the nut, disconnect the 4-pin electrical socket, and slowly pull out the UV bulb. Step 3. Carefully insert the bulb into the quartz tube through the open end nut. Tightly connect the 4-pin electrical socket with the new UV bulb and install the cover cap back to the nut. Step 4. Push the control switch button to the auto position. Step 5. Turn on the faucet and ensure the new UV bulb works properly. Step 6. Turn off the faucet and ensure the automatic flow switch shuts off automatically when water stops flowing through. Congratulations! Your iSpring UV filter is now ready for use. Please refer to the user manual or contact us directly if you have any questions. Thank you for watching.